Okay, this is question 16 on OCR um, A-level chemistry 2021. So this question is about magnesium is magnesium halides. Magnesium has a metallic bonding and is a good conductor of electricity. Describe with the aid of the label diagram the metallic bonding in magnesium and explain why magnesium conducts electricity. That's all you have to do. Include correct charges on the particles of your diagram. So all you have to do is do the circles. Like that. Always do like... I think you just have to do at least two. I give it three if you want to. Two will do. Because magnesium is a group two, it charges two plus. So they're all the same size, by the way. Two plus, two plus, two plus, two plus. And then you have the negative charge going. So every two plus, you got two negatives. Every two plus, you have two negative charges. One, two, and one, two. Now, if you don't label, then you'll be incorrect diagram. So you label that at the localized electrons. And then you can put positive ions. You can put also in a fixed lattice. So that's the representation of metallic bonding. Then it just says, uh, Explain why magnesium conducts electricity because it has, it has the localized electrons that are able to move. Therefore, conducts electricity. Okay. So that funny noise you hear in the background is a snoring dog, by the way. So just don't think it's anything, anything more than that. I always got dogs around me when I'm teaching. So they're all learning chemistry with you guys. Right, now we can move on to the next question. So there's a 12 successive ionization energy of magnesium as shown below. So you got all of them. As you can see, that doubles and then it's much bigger than here. So there's a big jump here, isn't there? Between second and third ionization energy. And then he carries on until here, until he, he goes bigger there, okay? But you don't have to look at it now. So just say, write an equation represent the fourth ionization energy of magnesium. All you do is like this. If you start here, Mg4 plus gas plus electron, arrow back, then you got Mg3 plus gas. And then you always get, that's the fourth ionization energy of magnesium. Then explain how successive ionization energy provides evidence that magnesium is in group two in the periodic table. So if you look at the pure product thing, there's a big jump between second and third ionization because you go 700, 1000, then you go 7000. So there's a, I would just say, there's a big jump between the second and the third ionization energy energies which shows that uh, there is a change of there is a change of shell Sorry, I can't remember. Change of shells. Uh, getting closer to the nucleus. Also, it tells you there's two electrons in the outer shell. Therefore, group two. There you are. So the next one says electrons occupy orbitals. It says in table 16.2 below, add a tick below the ionization energy numbers that are responsible for removing an electron from a full orbital in a magnesium atom. So if you say a magnesium atom has got 12, so give it 1s2, then you've got 2s2, just to explain that, 2s2, then you've got 2p6, with six here, one, two, three, 
four, five, six. So that's two P six. And then you got three S two. Okay. So that's a full shell here. Right. So what you do here, the first electron coming out is in, hold on. Hold on in. So let's start again. So it goes, the first electron to remove from here, so it comes from 3S subshell, okay, orbital. So the first one is out. So the first one is out. Second one is not full. Then the second one, the third one is coming from here. So that's a full orbital. So you can take one from here. So it'll be one, two. So the first one, two is not, three is on. Then you go four, it's another full orbital, and five. So it's four and five. And then you jump up to 2S. Then you got, um, have I got this one? So one, one, two, three, four. Yeah. Then you have five there. And then you got, hold on, I've sorry. I was just explaining that again. I'm going to do it again. Uh, so the first one comes out of here. Then you got two. Then you got three, four, five. They, they all full. Then you got six, seven, eight. So six, seven, eight, you don't, they are all half shells. Then you got nine, so it comes from here. Then you got 10, 10, and then you got 11, so 11. So that's how you see them. I hope that's helpful. I'm sorry I had to stop a few times because I got dogs snoring all over me and making lots of noises. Thank you. So my beautiful dog, Coco. Yeah, you are. And this one is my other dog called Hugo. So I'll give you a treat because you always hear dogs. So they are a bit tired. And then you have my little Bella. Yes, my Bella. And then you have a gorgeous bull. She's probably the one that's making all the noise. So that's a little bit of treat for you, the young aggressor.